As we all know, grief and tolerance prevents Anglophiles from living a normal life. Would you like to know what they like to add at the very end of their DVDs and where those griefs and tolerant Anglophiles come from? If someone gets diarrhea from fish and chips that means they are very disgusting. Me 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 me. Hey, shut the fuck up you fucking fat ass. Hey I'm not fucking fat you can't. Amorous, did you just say the F word? Well, I can't eat fish and chips without having liquid shit pouring out my asshole. Julie. Why the fuck wouldn't Anglophile even get the shits from fish and chips? Faye. I would use fish and chips to relieve my damn constipation. Bagaby. People who get diarrhea from fish and chips are very retarded nasty ass Mexican bitches. Pixie. Dad, I can't eat fish and chips without having very bad belly pain and liquid shit running down my leg. How would you like to get grounded? How would you like to stop being a mean ass dad? What did you say? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. What I said was, how would you like to stop being a mean ass dad? Stephen Bruce Smallwood. Adolf, you should really be ashamed of yourself. Grease and tolerance is one of the worst things ever invented in Mexico. But dad, if I ate fish and chips, my belly would really hurt so badly I'll have diarrhea running down my leg and I'll lose all my weight from dehydration. Let me read this note then. Eat penguin shit. You ask the lunker. I'm obsessed with Gonimov and I like to add the white stream of death at the very end of my fucking homemade DVDs because fish and chips and Mexican water have the same effect on me. That's also the reason why my MP, AA, R18 rating and all my MI6 warnings have Spanish during the terms. Ha 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 ha